Yo, this is Itano Play, Xenogears, and today is the final day of 2021. 2022 is tomorrow. So, I uh, hope you guys are gonna have a nice New Year's Eve today. And uh, hopefully, 2022 will be better than 2021 because we hope the pandemic will be over, but apparently, it's not. Hopefully, 2022 will be, be better though because, man, have you seen all the gaming news coming out? 2022, new Zelda game. We even have rumors of Chrono Cross remaster. Uh, new Kirby game, a lot of great other JRPGs coming out, oh my god, I mean, come on, 2022 looks to be so good, I can't wait for tomorrow, it's gonna be great, hopefully with less pandemic as well, but we'll see, anyways, we are still in Solaris, we got through the, uh, the sewer area here, and now we're in a big house, which is uh, not just any big house, let Ellie tell us which house this is. Where are we? The first class citizen level. This is where Solaris people call Gazelle live. Follow me. W wait! The guard robot will make get you again if you go in there. Don't worry. This is my house. Your house? This big house is yours? And yet this is a huge house. Damn. Yep. Come on in! So now we've gotten to the home of Ellie. And, uh, wow, huge house. Oh, let's go explore! Huh? Ellie? Ellie, is that you? Mother! You. I'm glad you're okay. The military told me you were missing in action. No, mother. That's not true. See? I'm alive. Mother, where is father? He's still at the palace. I think he'll be back soon. I see. Ellie, who's this? What? Ah, uh, um... He's on the special forces. The same as me. He was only recently promoted from third class citizen. It's because of him I was able to return. Right, Faye? What? Um, no, I mean... I see. That must be why he's dressed like a land dweller. But why isn't he wearing a special unisport uniform like you, Ellie? Uh, sorry, Mother. There's a point I must turn in right away, so... Faye, come with me. Yikes. Oh well, this has to obey. Hopefully she doesn't get suspicious. This is my room. Ah, I can finally relax. This place is huge. We'll be bigger than the village chiefs. Heh. <laughs> I'm sweaty after running, so I'm taking a shower. Do you have a bathroom in your room? It's pretty normal. Not normal. When are you gonna stop staring? Oh. Oh boy, she is indeed shuddering. Hey, Ellie. Was that your mother? Yes. Oh. She sure is a pretty lady. Yes, she is. But you don't look much like her. Do you resemble your father? Haven't you noticed yet? What do you mean? The color of my skin, hair and eyes are different from normal Solarians. I never paid any attention to it, really. A long time ago, when I was a small, I had a nanny. She was so nice to me. But she was a land dweller, and first-class citizens rarely associate with them. But the nanny lived in our house and took care of me. She lost her child when she was in the third-class area. My dad felt sorry for her and kept her under his protection. But he never told anyone about her. Why? 
My father was worried about my appearance. He had a reason for it. She was probably my real... Ellie? I'd better not. I'm sure you don't want to hear about this. Sorry. That's alright. So that's probably it. So... The nanny was probably the mother, I guess. And Medina, which you just saw, is probably... Not the mother. Now it's your turn. No thanks. I don't have time for that. You need to relax. You don't get a chat like this very often. Please. Alright, if you insist. You should have listened to me in the first place. Ugh. And then... Please, shall we? Wah! You're fine. Just relax. Wow. Feels good. There's a world of difference between this and Dark Soul bathtub. Huh? Ah! Stop it! Stop staring at me! Don't worry. I'm not looking. I'm just adjusting it. How's the temperature? Hey, I'm fine! Go away! Now! Haha! <laughs> Stay's gonna keep sight on him! Uh, I think there's a bit of a. a bit of a funny things going on between these two. I feel refreshed. Now, what I'm gonna do? There's no time to relax. Yes, I really don't want to. But there's no other choice. You have any good ideas? The network terminal in my father's room. He got angry with me for touching it once. There's numerous information only a handful of people have access to. So we can find out where Bart and others are located from that? I hope so. Well, let's do some exploration again. So, man, a bathtub in your own living room? I mean, the room is huge. I mean, this, this room is probably as big as my old apartment that I live in right now. Man. Nice to have this big room still, but I don't mind having a small location because big location means you also have to spend a lot of time uh, cleaning. So, it's an advantage and disadvantage at the same time, I guess. Is it this place? Oh, that's probably the living area. That's the entrance. Uh, must be here then, I guess. Oh, Ellie. What are you doing in your father's room? Don't you remember how mad he got last time? What am I gonna do with you? Guess we don't care. Can we enter now, or...? Maybe that was the right wrong room? Maybe that was the wrong room. Maybe this was the right room after all, then. Is that the nanny, I guess? Oh, Miss Ellie! You're still alive! I'm so happy to see you! I thought you passed away. Master will be so happy! Oh, yes, it's a present for you from the Master! Psycho Rod! Please take good care of it! So that probably is Melly's real mother, I guess, but she needs a bit different hair color, though. Psycho Rob with a new weapon for Ellie, which she probably should equip. Because you will be using Ellie for quite some time with Faye and one more, which I think you will know is going to be. <coughs> so let's go more into details. Okay, maybe just check out with Medina. Ellie, I'm so happy. Let me see you. Your father said you'd be back. I almost gave up hope. Mother, are you staying for a while? This time you should relax. Your father will be so happy. Yes, I guess. Let's have a nice meal. Faye, would you like to join us? Ellie never invites her friends over. I'm glad you're here. Well, I'm gonna go shopping to make yourself comfortable. 
Ah, that was what we had to do. We had to get her to go. Nah, she feel like a nice mother, so... Maybe she feels a bit guilt that she's not the real mother of, El of Ellie, but... She seemed like a nice lady. You know, the old Solarins are cocky assholes, I guess. Well, let's go into this room, then. The Forbidden Room. This is it! If we can break through the palace network security by accessing this... ID. The password will probably be something related to me. Elheim. Access denied. Enter the correct password. That's not good. Let's try it backwards. Miale. Welcome to SolarisNet. You have 19 unread emails. Yes, got it. Let's see. We were here before, so... Wow, it connects to here. Faye, we should be able to get it where everyone is. From a trash chute in the third class citizen level. That means we're getting back to that first location. Now we know where we are. Let's hurry. Ellie, where are you? Father! What are you doing, Ellie? I told him before not to come in here and touch that machine. Is this the guard? It's me, Eric. A burglar broke in here. Yeah, come quickly. Father! Faye's not a burglar! Then what is he? A strange man in my room? Isn't he a burglar? There's a reason. Please, don't shoot him. Faye just wants to save his captured friends. They're my friends too. No. Even if he's your friend. I can't overlook a land dweller who tries to sneak into the palace. Fine. I'm the most a traitor. Go ahead and shoot me. No, you're staying here. Now move out of the way, Ellie. No! No, traitors are punished even if they're first class citizens. You'll be safe if we kill the intruder who knows about us. I'm worried about your safety. You're lying! You just hate being in any position that dangers you. You know what you didn't want me to join, Jujin? You just didn't want everyone to see your own daughter. Because I'm half land dweller. Uh. I can't believe you still. How dare you say that in front of your mother? Because. Stop it. I don't want to see father and daughter fight because of me. I won't cause you any more trouble. I came of my own will. I'm in tutor. If I just get out of here, I'll be fine. Faye? Ellie. You shouldn't say that in front of your mother. I don't know the truth, but she is your mother, not a stranger. Isn't that right? Now get out of the way. I have to hurt to save my friends, but if you intend to shoot me, I'll put up a big fight. Hmm? Father? The intruder has escaped. Now get out of here. It'll be well until the guards get here. You may be an intruder, but the fact is, you protected my daughter. If I shoot you, I'll lose her. Father! Let me go with Faye! No. I can't let you go. But... That's alright. This is a land dweller problem now. We won't trouble you any further. I'll go by myself. Faye! Ellie, this time, leave the military. Thanks for everything. Faye! Oh dear, bye bye Ellie. Good luck. Uh, back to entry rank again. And Faye is uh, trying to uh, escape. Now here's a little bit of a problem. Remember when we were having to talk to people like randomly that was talking about you know, pop shoes and being elite assholes. 
Well, now is a problem. Oh, no, that was yeah, since Eleanor with us anymore, we can't translate what they're talking about because apparently people speak in a different language. Yeah, no idea what they're saying, and we don't even know what to do. It's kind of bad, right? Well, remember that we had to go to the third class citizen level, basically from where we entered with the worker bee section. So, this was the place we went from, right? Let's go inside again. Talk to us, that's kinda creepy. Hey you! Aren't you the one for the dedication? You're under arrest. Get in that door. Uh he that guy speaks like other one of the people though. What are you gonna do to me? As I suspected, you know nothing. Hey, it's a town! Doc! Satan! Why are you here? I saw Bart's image on the bird vision in the dedication. You saw that too, Doc? Yes. But I did not see either of you. Soon after, I heard I was an intruder on the second floor of the Arabato grounds. I suspect it was probably you, so I waited here. After that, I did not hear anything about the capture of any intruders. How did you know I was going to be here? The best possible way to sneak into the palace is through the dust chute. And to get back to the third floor, one must pass through this observation tower. I always been thinking, do you think it could possibly be a little more subtle? In infiltrating enemy ground, the most basic thing to do is to be stealthy. That amount of activity you have stirred up, you can even wake up the dead. Well, I was actually trying to be subtle. By the way, what happened to Ellie? Was she not with you? Ellie. She went back home. She really shouldn't have any relation with us land dwellers. Sure they are such wonderful parents. I see. Yes. It may have been better for her that 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 way. Let's head for a dust shoot then. Yeah. Now Faye, stay very close to me. That way does not pick up on your presence. Huh? Doc, hold on! How can you get past here? According to Ellie, only first class citizen and military personnel can pass through. Huh? Um, well, that is. Uh, probably they had not deleted my ID from the days I was in the military. It's still stored in the databank. My, how the Solaris monitors are sloppy. Ha <laughs> ha! Uh, okay, that, I mean, it's been many years since uh, Satan was in Solaris, right? So, we then deleted after these many years. Uh, I kind of have to agree a bit. That's kind of sloppy indeed. But hey, shouldn't complain, right? Now we have to go back here again. But now, it's a bit easier. I'll just use this elevator here, I think. We should be able to go right out. Oh yeah. Because of the stir, the security robots are gone. Which is nice. We can go here now. Go straight out. Not bad, right? And we are back on the third class level area. Nice. The dust chute is here. So next episode, guys, we're going to go inside the dust chute. We're going to see if we can get inside the palace, see if we can find Bart, Billy, and the rest. Try to rescue them, and hopefully that will make things uh, better, in a way. I hope. But it's gonna be quite a long trip. See, the dust chute area to the palace is very, very long. And it has some 
cool scene, some absurd scene, some really, really grotesque scene. And then comes a plot twist. A very huge one. Probably the biggest plot twist so far, I would say. So get ready, guys. You get ready for some action where you think you knew everything and then you totally don't. Well, this episode is going to be exactly that. You don't know everything about Zero Gears until you play this part. Oh boy. Like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on social media. That's going to be for now. See you next time as my journey to Zero Gears continues in 2022. Happy New Year, everyone. See you in 2022.